Tomorrow, 104.3 WOMC will host a 13 hour radiothon to support the Children's Miracle Network. Stephen Clark and Joanne Purton, longtime Channel 7 fixtures, will broadcast live from Beaumont Hospital in Royal Oak. And this morning, we're joined by Kate Graudis, the Associate Director of the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals, and Samantha Hendricks, whose son was diagnosed with uh, lymphocytic leukemia. Thank you both for joining us this morning. Now, um, Kate, tell us a little bit about the Children's Miracle Network and what it does. Yeah. Children's Miracle Network is a nationwide nonprofit. Um, in the state of Michigan, we are located at Beaumont Children's. So what we do is raise funds for kids in the hospital. And 100% of the funds that we raise stay local here in Southeast Michigan. Is this for their treatment or for life out around their treatment and surrounding it? Uh, a little bit of everything. We um, do, we support treatment for kids with cancer. We support equipment for babies in the neonatal intensive care unit different therapies, pet therapy, music therapy, kind of the whole spectrum. And Samantha, your son is, uh, has been diagnosed with leukemia. Tell us a little bit about him. What's his name? What is he like? How old is he? His name is Jonathan and he is 11 years old. He was diagnosed in 2013 with leukemia and he is one of the brightest kids I know, one of the most caring. Um, he loves to give back. Um, no matter what he's going through. He just always looks towards the brightest things. Now, as you and your family and Jonathan have battled leukemia, how has the Children's Miracle Network helped support you guys in this struggle? One of the biggest things that they do is um, supply um, child life specialists to the hospital. And they're there not only just for the kids, but for the parents too. Um, they help the parents, they give the parents breaks when they need breaks. and. One big thing is they do with the kids is they let the kids be kids while still in the hospital, no matter what they're going through. They running up and down the hallways with them and just doing all kinds of things just to so that they could keep their childhood. Because so much of healing is about attitude and about how you feel. And it sounds like in this case, you know, those child life specialists really help Jonathan and other children keep their spirits up. Right. Yeah. What's his prognosis? It's good. Um, he is in remission um, and he will continue treatment until April of next year. And then we'll just see from there. All know. right. Well, thank you so much for sharing your story. And Jonathan, if you're watching, we're rooting for you. We want you to get better fast. And we'd love for you to come on the show someday and tell us how things are going. If you'd like to participate and donate to the uh, 104.3 WOMC Radiothon benefiting the Children's Miracle Network, it is tomorrow from 6 a.m. to 7 p.m. The number's right there on your screen. And you can also donate by text at WOMC Kids. Send WOMC Kids to 15555. Kate, thank you so much thank for joining you. us. Thank you for having us. Samantha, thank you so thank much you. for joining us. And again, we wish you and Jonathan the best. Thank you. We'll be right back.